Right, so this is how you update Luma 3DS manually with a PC. I will of course be using my Legion Go for this, but it runs Windows 11, so it doesn't really matter. And uh, I will be using a new 3DS XL for this, but it doesn't matter what 3DS or 2DS you have, as long as it's from the 3DS family. So, first things first is take out the SD card. For me, it's back here. So I have to unscrew these screws. But just take out your SD card. There we go. And then what you're going to do is you are going to plug it into your PC. Let's see here. And there we go. Let me just make sure that's connected here. And yes, it is. And now we will be downloading the newest Luma version. So I am just going to search up Luma 3DS. Just do that. And then you go on to the GitHub file right here. The GitHub one. Just press on that. Here you can see the latest version for me is 13.3.3, but uh, you might have a newer one because there might have been a newer one. And uh, yeah, this one really fixed a lot of bug bugs, a lot of bug fixes on this one. So what you're gonna do is go down to assets and then you're going to press on the Luma 3DS v13.3.3 dot zip, the zip file here. Boom, that is now downloaded. I'm just gonna exit out of that. Go on to downloads, and then unzip this, extract all. You might need something like 7-zip for this, but I don't. Here we have config. You can just take all of these files once you have them unzipped. You know what, I'll just show that again. Here we have the unzipped folder, Luma 3DS. Open that, take all of these files and put them on the root of your SD card. And uh, with the root, I mean right on the SD card, not inside of a folder or anything, right on the SD card. And then this thing will pop up. The destination is two files with the same names. You're going to press replace the files in the destination. This will, of course, replace the old Luma 3DS files. And yep, that is now done can just safely eject the SD card here. Eject, there we go. Now you can just take that out and plug it back into your 3DS. Damn, a lot of dust in here. Yup, I need to clean this. Boom. Put this on again. If you have a new 3DS Excel, you have to put it from the bottom here. Put it on the bottom first and then the top. A little weird that it's like that, but it's like that. Screw these back in. Boom. And now, and now, there we go. You can power on your 3DS. And this Luma 3DS screen will pop up. And uh, yeah, as you can see, 13.3.3, which is the version that I installed. And um, if the, this screen does not pop up, or if this pops up, you just press start, and you will be taken to the home screen. If this did not pop up, and I'll show you what to do. First, just make sure what version you are on. There we go. 13.3.3, that's the latest one for me. So just find out what the latest one is for you and which one you installed. And then you can power off your 3DS and then you're going to press select and power it on. And boom, Luma 3DS will pop up. And here you can see I am on the latest version, 13.3.3. And you will now also be on the latest version, 13.3.3. If that's the one you installed and not something lower down. So, um, yeah, that's how you do that. And once again, once this screen comes up to remove it, you can either press start or you can go down here and press on save and exit. But I just usually just press start. 
And uh, yeah, that's how you do that. Thank you guys for watching. I usually make uh, videos on when new new Luma versions come out. So um, just subscribe, like, subscribe if you want to stay updated on those. And caught on camera. 4K, by the way. Goddamn. But um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Like, dislike, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace out.